Yeah, cash, it's a king. But is it? Worldwide, there's a shift towards cashless payments. In the U.S., more than 40% of Americans say they do not use cash to pay for anything in a typical week. And amid this trend, a growing number of businesses are requiring patrons to use credit cards, debit cards, or smartphone apps to pay for goods and services. I believe credit card is more safe, mm -hmm. but uh, we do take cash because I grew up in 1977, so <laughs> those days we only had a lot of cash. Legislation in Florida would ban most businesses from joining the cashless trend. Chevron Jones is one of the sponsors who argues cashless policies discriminate against those who don't use traditional banks and frustrate older folks who simply prefer cash. Many Floridians, uh, specifically our senior citizens and our minority communities, they rely on cash to make their payments for goods and for services, either by necessity or for choice. And this bill will require certain businesses to accept cash payments for in-person transactions and prohibit these businesses from charging a fee or placing conditions on the transaction. Florida is not alone. More than a dozen U.S. states require retail businesses to accept cash. I witnessed it myself with my grandmother. She only carries cash, and there have been times in the past where I've had to call credit card companies myself on her behalf because she doesn't know how to make a payment, she doesn't even know how to use them. I think it's definitely a good idea that the city continue to enforce that stores and boutiques you know, accept cash, because otherwise, what are we going to do for the elderly and for people that are visiting that can't pay with card or Apple Pay? Many businesses argue that eliminating cash increases efficiency and improves customer service. No more counting cash or making change. Big Florida sports and entertainment arenas like the Hard Rock Stadium and the Kaseya Center are already cashless. However, they have reverse ATMs where people can deposit cash and get a debit card. Here in Florida, the bill mandating a cash option is expected to pass. And though the push for a more digital world is strong, here the reaction adds to evidence that plenty of people still like the immediacy, the privacy and anonymity cash provides. Nitsa Soledad Perez, CGTN, Miami.